And I'm going to be supportive because of this one singular statement under the resolve clause by the Senate and the House of Representatives that the Senate believes Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman is responsible for the murder of Jamal Khashoggi. That, regardless of all of my other concerns about language, is the central essence of what the chairman is going to do. I think it's incredibly important for the Senate to speak on that issue and hopefully speak with one voice. So with that, I will withdraw my objection. The question is on the passage of the joint resolution. All in favor say aye. Aye. Ayes appear to have it. The ayes do have it. Joint resolution is passed. I want to reiterate what the ranking member just said. This is now unanimously, unanimously, the United States Senate has said that Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman is responsible for the murder of Jamal Khashoggi. That is a strong statement. I think it speaks to the values that we hold dear. The rest of this resolution does. I'm glad the Senate is speaking with one voice unanimously toward this end. I thank the leader for accommodating making this happen. And with that, that, with that I yield the floor. Are there any senators in the chamber who wish to vote or change their vote? See none. The results are 56 yeas and 41 nays. The resolution is agreed to as amended.